How's it going gamers and welcome to the channel. My name is Q and uh, today we're talking about upgrading the Final Fantasy 7 on PlayStation 4 to the PS5 version. And I've been hearing a lot of talk or seeing a lot of talk online about how difficult it is uh, to upgrade to the PS5 version. And uh, in this video, I'm just going to show you the quick and easy way to do so. Uh, I didn't find it personally difficult to upgrade my PS4 version to the PS5. So yeah, I just don't know what people are talking about but hopefully this video will clear up any type of uh, issues that you guys are having upgrading your version up to the ps5 version uh, so first thing you'll notice here uh, when you boot up the game because i actually have claimed the game uh, for free on playstation plus as well too so i have it digitally but i have the physical copy so when you uh, you know go and um put the physical copy in what you're going to realize is that uh, it's going to give you this message uh, you know you you want to switch from the download version to the disc version and what it's going to do is it's going to delete uh, if you have the digital only version on your machine on your ps5 it'll delete that and it'll switch it over to the physical version so basically put your disc in and go ahead and hit delete and then uh, from that standpoint what it's going to do is it's going to install uh, the uh, you know the game over again, but it's going to be set up in a way where it's going to require a disc uh, to validate it. So for some of you guys that don't understand the physical version, you still got to install the game, um, but the disc itself is your authentication key, whereas the digital version, the key is already uh, a part of the file that's being downloaded. So from that point, um, I'm right now installing the physical version onto my PlayStation 5 because it's already deleted the digital version. Uh, so once that happens, um, and I'll pass through all the installation process so we can go right into it what you're going to see is you're going to see uh, that the game already ready installed on your machine and uh, what you want to do is uh, go into the actual game itself and uh, let me show you real quick so what you'll see when the game is fully installed switching from the digital version to the physical version and for a lot of you players out there that just have the physical version um, you'll just go right into the, the the game menu here so instead of hitting play game hit the three dots that's right next to the play game and then a menu will open up and choose view view products so if you view the product uh, what it's going to do is going to send you over to the Final Fantasy VII Integrate uh, info information. You know, it's going to show it as $69.99. Uh, go ahead from there. Uh, again, move over to the right and hit the three dots again one more time. When you hit the three dots one more time, what you're going to see is another menu. Uh, the first option is going to say to unfollow the game, so you don't want to do that. Uh, click on the second option, which for you guys should say Final Fantasy VII Remake upgrade for ps4 version owners so when you click on that option what you're going to see is it's going to take you to the final fantasy 7 remake ps5 upgrade and it'll say disc required and it'll say free with the little disc logo so just click on that and once you click on that it says hey do you want to accept um, the upgrade hit accept and it's going to download um, well actually before you, you hit accept then you've got to confirm your purchase which is free and then you'll get an email receipt to your PlayStation account and go ahead and hit download and it's going to download the PS5 version of Final Fantasy 7 remake for you so really not that challenging uh, to find it I think it's a little bit hidden because it's in the three dots right there it doesn't really tell you up front uh, but uh, you know outside of that you know, that's the quick and easy way to download and upgrade your PS4 version of Final Fantasy VII Remake to the PS5 version. So with that, guys, uh, put, post your comments if you guys have any questions. To me, I thought it was pretty straightforward, um, but maybe uh, to you know a few people out there, they would rather have it much more noticeable when you go into your Final Fantasy VII game that the upgrade option is a little bit more highlighted in the in the forefront of the title. But, you know, outside of that, I think, you know, overall, it's it's. It's, an, it's a simple upgrade. Uh, I, I wouldn't uh, clamor or complain too much about upgrading uh, the PS4 version to the PS5 version. So with that, guys, again, let me know what your thoughts are. Post your comments. If you're new here, subscribe to the channel. Um, you know, Dislike if you didn't like this content. Like if you do. Uh, like I said, I do this for fun. So I figure I do a quick video to kind of show you how quick and easy it is uh, to upgrade your, your version to the PS5. So with that, guys, have a great day. Hope you guys are um, you know having a great time. I'll talk to you guys later. Take care.